Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. As you can see, I went to Walmart. Cereal, protein, and chicken thighs. I'm a simple man. Simple. Okay. 20 bucks. The cereal was 10 bucks. The chicken thighs was like 9 bucks. Um, you got to eat the right food. Now, corn cereal, okay, it's corn based. And they say honey bunches and oats. And I say they say. I shouldn't say they say. There have been reports that it is a bit cancer causing. I'm on my bulk. I'm not worried about it. I've had worse in my body that I've found out. <laughs> I'll be fine. It's just a snack. I'm just having two cups, as you see, as you could see earlier, two cups of the cereal and one cup of 2% milk. 2% is the best milk. I don't care what anyone says. If that made somebody click off, good. I don't want them anywhere near my channel. They can go on the other side of YouTube where they tell, where they get fake news total anyways. You have to track your calories. Here I am, my fitness pal. I'm new to this. Uh, this is my day so far, or really my entire day as it's planned. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks. Very simple. I got my cereal and my protein shake as snacks. I haven't drank my protein shake. That's going to be the last thing I do as far as food. You have to track your calories. You have to, when you set your goal, know your macros. Whether you're trying to lose weight or gain weight, you should be aiming towards one gram of protein per pound of body weight. Even if you're maintenance, you're being maintenance, you should anything less. Okay, anything less, I think you're deficient in protein then. That's my thought. Okay, society is weak. Of course, they're going to tell you, you don't need that much protein. And then they also tell you as a man, you that fat's bad for you. Don't 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 have fat. Cholesterol is the building blocks of the cell wall, testosterone itself, cortisol, all of these things. It's very necessary. Anyways, last night, I mean yesterday, I ate a lot, but last night, I have it recorded in my journal. And I by the way, I weigh myself but booty naked. I weighed 133.2. This morning. 131.2 what am i gonna weigh tonight i'll let y'all know in the recap because i weighed myself before a cold shower but i'm i feel better i feel strong okay i'm about to hit a workout right after i drop this video actually the push day it's push day baby um okay i look like a boomer for a second push day baby um what the freak am I doing? Oh my goodness. Track your calories, man. Track your workouts and track your calories. Stick to it. You can't just be changing every three days. Oh my gosh, this is hard. I'm going to do something else. You're not going to get data. You're not going to get progress and results. Stick to something at least a month. That's what I'm really. I'm switching a lot. I'm trying to absorb and gain from everything. And I'm trying to build this nice, nice routine. I just need to stick to you can only okay the proportion to what to what you can learn and apply it's not symmetrical you have to apply stuff for a while to know to get the data and it's really not a loss because then you have first-hand data first-hand experience competence and then you know what to do based off the direction that that, that data tells you so Track your, track your calories. It's very necessary. If you want to get gains, if you want to gain weight, it's very necessary. My goals, 3,000 calories every single day, one gram of uh, protein per pound of body. <clears throat> and I feel phenomenal eating more. So non-negotiable in the morning, eggs, boron. This, t this morning, I because I didn't have my protein shake with me and we had to go to Walmart because I was out. Grits, cheese, you can you you got you gotta measure. I see a, a quarter cup of grits, a quarter cup of cheese, and a quarter teaspoon of salt and season. Sausage patties, two patties. Very simple. Okay? It shows all your fat and your macros, everything you need. I have 
plenty here. Realistically, I have more water intake. Now, I had some chicken while on the group call. Captain D's tonight, that was a big meal. I just ate that basically like an hour ago. That's a good bit of calories. <laughs> and I also had uh, the cereal before the Captain D's. That's 400 calories of a of a snack. Plenty of carbs, sodium, a bit of protein actually, as you can see. Very nice. So you need to be tracking your calories. Do something like this. We have so many resources in this world. You're just being lazy and not planning to plan. Therefore, you're planning to fail. Cliche. Get to work. Get your gains. Train with intensity. That's what I am about to do. Which is easy. It's it's push day. I'm a dude. Like days, I've noticed. I, I like like days, to be honest. It's tough, but I think I like them more than a regular dude. So, anyways, get to work. Eat up. Get in the gym. Be calculated. And if you want to be competent and you want to get results, you're going to be calculated. You're going to be tracking data. You're going to keep pushing and doing what you need to do every single day. Love you. Jesus loves you. I'll see you all in the recap. Peace.